Yo, what's going on, guys? Matthew V. Hates here, a.k.a. The Clockmaster. I'm here with my wife. Shannon, a.k.a. Cosmic Thinks. And we are here to check out... Gen V, episode 5. Episode 5. So the reason why there is no reaction on the channel for episode 4 is because we already watched episode 4 before filming this, like, out, like, out you know, out of, like, recording, like, out of reactions or whatever like that. So there is no reaction for episode 4, because as you know, there was a review on the channel for gen v for episode one to four so there's no reaction for that but we're here for episode five <laughs> so yeah um the last episode was pretty good even though it was off camera really quickly mm -hmm. your brief thoughts on episode four and how you feel about gen v really quickly yeah um i'm thinking like i'm very interested in sam as a character and seeing more about him because he's very complicated right now and you know he's got a very interesting life going on and a lot of trauma and yeah you know emma is kind of balancing him so it's kind of interesting to me yeah, yeah. emma's definitely balancing him out yeah i think that's like the main thing i'm getting from a lot of these episodes is emma yeah because i think her as a character as well is just very intriguing so yeah she's like a she's like a very um She's she's more she's more of an important character than you actually like really think initially. Because mm -hmm. you see you see her in the first episode. Yeah, like, oh, it's just the roommate. Yeah, yeah, just the roommate best friend thing. But she's actually playing a very pivotal role. And then yeah. we found that she can get bigger. Yeah. In the last episode yeah. now. And then she was able to, you know, kind of stop him. Mm -hmm. So she might be the only one that could actually contend with him yeah. because of that factor. The mm -hmm. fact that she can get big. Yeah. And of course, Jordan, Jordan is Jordan. I mean, Jordan fought Golden Boy. Yeah. So we know Jordan's pretty strong. Yeah. And and speaking of Jordan, Jordan and uh and Marie yeah. are hooking up now. Yeah. And then Marie's having blackouts. Yeah, I don't know what's happening. What's going on with that? I don't know. <laughs> it's like she's having like black she's like having episode. blackouts of some sort. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe we'll see in this episode what's going yeah. on. Maybe we'll see what's going on with that. Yeah. But um, but yeah, so that's it for this. I think we'll just leave it at that. So we're not making it a whole recap video. Yeah. Um, but check out the full reaction on Patreon to this episode and episodes one to three. Like I said, episode four wouldn't be on there. But uh, check out the full reactions on Patreon. And yeah, subscribe to the channel if you like what you're seeing later on in the video. Obviously, you don't have to subscribe now because you just came here. But, like, <laughs> but later on in the video, if you enjoy it, definitely subscribe. Yeah. And uh, check out Chan's personal channel, Cosmic Binks. We're a little bit late on the, mo on the movie reactions over there. It's been really hectic over here, but we Very. are planning to get back more horror stuff over there. At least hopefully we can get at least one or two more out before the season, the Halloween season yeah, is over. Yeah, I'm hoping. Hopefully. We already have one in the bag. We just got to get at least one more. Yeah. You know, just uh, at least yeah, yeah, at least right. get three out. You know what I mean? Like yeah. total, you know? But anyways, that's it. Um, Yeah, we'll talk about it later as you normally do. Let's get into it. Now, what the heck is that? What the hell? What? What is that? Why is there like slobber? What the hell? What the freak? What is that? You know what oh. I mean? Do you? Mm. So the it's heck? not just Marie. Yeah, what the heck happened? Yeah. yeah. Man, don't act like y'all wasn't just doing what y'all was doing. Right. They don't remember it either, though. Yeah. So what is actually happening? Yeah, what the hell is that? Ew. Ew, what is happening? Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. So that's what it is. I don't like that. Ew, it's definitely Gen V. It's so gross every time. <laughs> they always do gross stuff. <laughs> Emma's just gigantic. Yeah. Fucking Saturday. Yeah, we need some explanation. Did someone catch them, knock them out, and force them to forget this stuff? Cardoza, maybe? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, here's videos. So they got TikToks of what happened. Mm -hmm. Trending. This might be Vought produced. No, there's Sam. Yeah, Did you know you could call me a monster and then made me swear never to do it again? Okay. You can only get small and petite. She's definitely one of those moms, man. Yeah. So, so she definitely is going straight to yeah. mail. There you go. Yeah. Jesus, Emma. Emma. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, there's Sam. 
Maybe he can tell us what's going on. Yeah. Why are you? What's your name? Yeah, yeah, you're, 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 None of them remember you're him. What is going girl. on? I think you're confused. You saw us on TV or TikTok. Oh or shoot! Tick. The doctor definitely has something to do you with this. Don't need help, Emma. At least Emma's are. still the helpful person. Yeah. Dangerous. Make you remember. Bro, remember wow. Emma is a hero. Yeah. It's all right. Mm. Is she still into him? She's still into him. <laughs> what? I lost track. You're insane. <laughs> I mean, next Friday. I mean, if, I mean, if you know, <laughs> if you need everyone to know your blood, what's going on with your blood? That's one to talk to. Of course, it's him. That they sent. Yeah, they, they would send Rufus. I, I mean, you did of, say that. Yeah. A viable the way virus. to control the blood guy for this shit. So you want to sure. race? Bruh. No, that's what they take. It's a skill that won't quite shine on your LinkedIn profile. <laughs> yeah, it actually, nah, it won't. Definitely. He really has nowhere else to go. He got no, he got no other credentials besides that. What girl? Marie. Marie? Why do you want her? Camera pointed at me. This freaking guy, He's man. Psychopath. Right. He definitely so deserved what happened to him in the last episode. Yeah. Coming after me for... That explains why Kate was like really thing when she like mind controlled him in the first episode oh, or yeah. second episode. Oh shit, Rufus. Uh oh, he better go kill him. He's gonna kill Rufus. Oh god. Yeah. Yeah, you don't mess with his girlfriend, man. Yeah. Big soup energy. <laughs> <laughs> that big soup energy. <laughs> yeah, now she's popular for a reason she don't even remember. Yeah. But it's just not gonna be worth it either. But this is what she wanted. Remember, she wanted to be popular. She wanted to be not, like love. No, I know, but I'm saying she's gonna find out it's not worth it either. Yeah. Between us, I mean. They are cute though. <laughs> yeah, they are kind of cute. <laughs> no, you don't. Can't lie. We weren't yeah. acting like ourselves. No, Jordan, just accept it. But you did. You kiss her before that, so. Yeah, no, she no, told him to but, do it. But I am sure. I can't trust a man with a name Rufus. Yep. Doppelganger trying to blend in. What were you talking to Shetty about? Yeah. Benny, what the? F Andre got me Good waiting job. right there. Yeah, knows. Andre. Get the fuck out of here, Jumanji. Well, how about you explain to me what you did to the rest of us and why? And maybe I'll consider not putting you to sleep for good. Ooh. Damn. Oh my God! He should have been more prepped for that, bro. He should have been more prepped for that. Oh, we don't God. know how his abilities work either. But he should have did more to research it. to find out something. You know when someone sounds something. Who gives a fuck what okay. it means? Hey, I do. Okay, go talk about that. Like them. I I like them. All right then. There we go. Play, play period. What? She has the shirt from the the movie theater. Yeah. God, poor Sam. I know. Has no res resources, no help. You said you were gonna save me. Oh, oh God. No. Now this is traumatizing him. It's just kind of like a uh, noir's like how you see cartoons. Not you. You're, mm -hmm. you're not. Jeez. Is this actually happening or no he's seeing this or is it actually happening and he's just seeing everyone as puppets yeah that's true you know what yeah is he seeing everyone as puppets it's, <laughs> it's so stupid <laughs> jeez it's the sound effects too i know you, you have to stop hurting people. No, that actually happened. No, this happened. Damn. Jeez. Damn. Jeez. Gosh. Golly. I don't know if that would have reached their gore limit. Yeah. Goodness God. Oh my God. Goodness God. What happened? Right under here. Unclotted. But what does that mean? 
Did it put something in her? Track her? Oh. Maybe, yeah. It's most likely in everyone else, too. Yeah. Then Rufus. I mean, it's much it's bigger than Rufus, yeah. Happen to be like this. She working with them? She knows, doesn't she? God, is she working with them, too? Not hers. Fuck. I mean, yeah, that is your problem. Yeah. You're assuming. These girls jerk off and sometimes oh my God. What the fuck, dude? Right. Yes. Yeah, shaming. No, that's um, more than that. Yeah, and now she's not going to remember. Remember what Jordan. exactly? It might just be the tracker hey. that she doesn't remember. Why would we chase him? Yeah, probably just race the past couple hours. He fucking wiped you again. Motherfucker. Wow. Jesus. Wait, no, it's this freaking is... Kate doing all of this. And she finds out about the tracker. What if Jordan already knows? I don't think Jordan knows. Is it anymore? I just Bruh. It's freaking Kate Ooh, doing it. Bro, so Kate's the sleeper agent yeah, here. Yeah, I mean, she's been trying to get Andre not to look into it this whole time. Yeah. Manipulation. What makes you so special? Wow. The manipulation the here. Wild. Oh, what the heck? This is getting too much. Dang, so she's been wiping them one by one. Mm -hmm. How does Rufus Rufus fit in all this? Because I feel like because Rufus clearly attacked Andre. Yeah. Did he's definitely playing a role? Did what happen? Or maybe he's not. Yeah, and did did that even what Kate claims happened? Did that even happen to her, or was she just playing victim to get them to pinpoint? This is breaking my heart. I know. All their memories. Yeah. She made Luke forget me too. Damn, that's Jeez. wow. Does he know? He know oh he knows his Kate. He knows it's he Kate. knows his Kate. For sure. Come here. That even happened with Rufus now? I'm questioning everything. Well, like him meeting with Rufus? No, uh, her, like her story. But that's what I'm trying to say. Like, did she did that even happen or did yeah. she just make herself look like a victim? And the thing that I was wondering is like, what if she manipulated her friends with the power? It was like, well, because... I'm taking note of when she has her gloves on and when she doesn't. Yeah. When she's been with Andre, she's always had her gloves on. Yeah, but we didn't know of like at what they do in at night. You know, when they sleep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. No, don't show her nothing. Oh. Yeah. But this. This time was actually not even Rufus. Don't let me go. I just want to talk. You at the party. Stop fucking lying. It's Kate. Please, please don't. Why would you say that? Mm -hmm. Sam's golden boy's brother. Over and over and over. And over. Look, I know Rufus is a wow. monster. Wow. Wow. Please, please, please don't. Oh, God. And it's Andre. Oh, Andre. No, 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 no. Andre, no. Andre. Oh, Andre. Move. This comeback's mine. Andre, wait, wait, wait. Oh, God. Bro, he you might actually die for no reason. Fucker. Tell them it isn't true. I'm so sorry. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Help and protect you. Yeah, it there it is. Make things better. Wow. There it is. Wow. No! No! no do not freaking touch him! Oh, she's making them remember? His girlfriend, the number one spot. Is that Maybe? Okay, she's we making him remember everything. Out. Wow. She should have never did this in the first place, Kate. But we don't know why she was being manipulated to do this. And she she got to go Ari Lennox, yo. But she got to... Uh, anyways. Wow. Fitting choice. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it's so funny that this song was brought up because I was just listening to this yesterday. Were you? Yeah. Dang, man. I don't think man, there's any... Man, that felt so short. Yeah, there's only 40 minutes of an episode. Okay. Oh, wow. Took down some noty notes. Oh wow. Episode, yeah, episode was pretty straightforward, but I did take down some notes real quick just to kind of keep a structure to the conversation. Um, I always keep forgetting that Seth Rogen's involved in this. Oh yeah. I keep I always keep forgetting that he's like an executive producer for yeah, the boys I and generally forgot about that. Yeah. Yeah. I always I always keep forgetting. Okay. Um. Yeah, man. So. All right. I don't know if you want to look at my notes and try to pick up something for you to go ahead and start, or you want me to go ahead, or you just ask you questions and we go like. I how mean, you want me to go. I'm just, you know, trying to figure out where this is gonna go now. What was Kate's like, you know, plan with that? Why she decided to do it in the first place? 
uh because this goes way back even she was saying that they um made luke forget yeah like over and over again that he even had a brother so that's why i'm wondering if like like there's just like has she been making up everything this whole time right. like i don't know what can be trusted what cannot be trusted you know like i don't know what is and isn't real you know yeah so a couple of things i can already check off the list because as we got through the episode got revelation things yeah, yeah. things we started to get revelations yeah. as to what happened so I, wrote, I, I write down so here's the thing when i when i write down or type my notes guys whenever i do i write down every little thing um that i notice in case and if it doesn't get brought up i can go back to it um but this stuff was already so the stuff that i'm about to list has already been already thing so the beginning of the episode there was slobbers coming from the room yeah, i figured out what that was we figured out what that was so no need to talk about that yeah. everyone got teleported we got an answer for that uh no one remembers we got an answer for that they made rufus they made i wrote down that they made them for uh, they sent rufus to make them forget we already got an answer to that already yeah. one thing that i want to circle real quick that we didn't get an answer for but we got a uh, uh, a thing for is that uh what's the name cardona cardoza cardoza yeah is making a virus of some sort yeah to control the soups it seems to control yeah to control them or to be able to have full you know autonomy over them in some way or whatever shut them well, down he said control like to have control yeah to have control so, what is that what does that mean like physically control them on a biological level with the virus it could be um in the sense that if they you know are you know unstable that yeah. they can just like you know pull them back and what do you think do you think that it would make them like them? do you think it would make them like um do you think it would make them uh lose their gen v abilities can be gen v their v abilities their v so, powers i'm kind of going off of the fact that sam keeps calling them puppets yeah you're all puppets so yeah. i from what i'm thinking is that they're kind of the virus is going to kind of control their movements and like control you know let's say Let's say, um, you know how Sam keeps escaping, they keep trying to get him. If he's injected with the virus, they have full control over him. If he's going off the deep end, then they can just pull him back, have like full control over his mind, his body, you know, stuff like that. Interesting, because I'm trying to think about the nature of how to go about this, because they can actually get the whole control aspect through a, a more technological approach. But if they're doing it for everybody, you know? Yeah, it might be easier to like inject like nano. But you would think that I don't I mean, we don't know. We don't know what they can actually make in the in the in the boys universe. Yeah. But you figure it would be a little easy that they would maybe make some type of fake flu shot or something and yes. put like nano nanites in it. Yeah. And I mean, they can easily be like, oh, to be on campus, you have to take this. Yeah, you got to take this shot yeah and shot. you know whatever or or it was some like some gen some like soup shot or whatever yeah and it has like nanites in it that can enter the brain i don't know we don't know the nature of technology we don't know yeah. if it's going to be bio uh by uh biologically based or if it's going to be more of a, a tech base yeah it's science obviously yeah I mean, but what he, nature of science is this virus going to be yeah and the fact that he wants marie because hers is the most rare that he's seen yeah like he's trying to get like a broad spectrum and plus his blood power so it might be able to get some type of answer well, of, as i said it might be quicker to get the results yeah exactly so so yeah interesting we need, yeah we need to pay attention I'm to that paying attention to the puppet aspect yeah that's a good that's a good that's a good point to pay I attention do, to i do think that has a bigger role than just you know sam you know talking about it seeing puppets and it's also a question if he's actually schizophrenic or if well yeah 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 to... did he like was they did you know did they cause did they cause a latent well if i'm not mistaken i believe well also okay because this episode makes you question everything because yeah the previous information about their mental health was that golden boy told us that they had mental health issues in their family mm -hmm. we can't necessarily believe that now because, because of kate 
and yeah. you know their manipulation that's with what, golden boy that's what i'm saying i don't know if he's actually yeah you know or what if kate was making him see things mm-hmm we really don't know. I mean, he's still seeing things now, so obviously something is wrong with him now. She, but we, we don't, don't know, know the extent of her ability. She could have literally messed up his brain. But that's what I'm trying to say. Like we, yeah. yeah. I mean, like we don't like she's not doing anything now at this moment. But something was done to him. Yeah. Either something was done to him at some point that messed up his brain so much. Because if you're messing around up in there all the time yeah. and you're mess, you know, experimenting on somebody, that can make someone go crazy. That can, you can create. You can create these problems with people yeah. by breaking their brains. Yeah. So it's very possible that Kate definitely did something yeah. to him. It's definitely a big question I have whether, you know, that was pre Kate or after Kate. Yeah, you can't. Or even pre Forest. Yeah, you can't. You can't take anything she says now. Even if it wasn't Kate, it literally could have been something to do with the doctors experimenting. Yeah. You know, there's just a, the constant experimentation and getting electrocuted. For, and, for all we know, they could have like triggered something in his brain to give him schizophrenia. So or or schizophrenic like yeah symptoms yeah because schizophrenia has very specific things yeah so but um if they gave him that to you know kind of work with different you know aspects in See, order to learn how to control different aspects yeah so yeah i don't know yeah. I, I, I don't know I, I don't know if they deliberately gave him yeah that's, that. that's a big question i think i just think that his mental health is a result of, or his declining mental health is a result of the constant experimentation. Yeah. And maybe, maybe even Kate, just like you said, I think that that's what I'm, I'm kind of leaning more towards what you're seeing with Kate, rather than them giving him a mental illness. I don't think, I don't think they can really get anything with that. I, f- I definitely, what they can do. I know, but your other theory, personally, I kind of agree with that more. Yeah. With them I'm just using throwing Kate. out different options. No, I got you. I got you. I'm not trying to discredit. I'm just saying what what I'm what yeah, I'm yeah, leaning yeah. more towards. I'm yeah, I'm kind of leaning more towards. Out of all the the theories you've suggested so far, the one I'm leaning more towards is the one that is Kate. Kate. Yeah. Kate and them just constantly experimenting on him yeah. and messing around in his brain in, enough to the point that it drives him insane. Yeah that's that yeah. to me that that seems like the more likely outcome but yeah it's you know, really hard to tell hard to tell yeah. what exactly happened yeah you know i don't know if we'll get an answer on that i don't know if we will but i i, I don't know if we will but sam obviously is now far more important than he was prior to this episode because yeah. he knows everything he knows and everything, yeah. unless kate goes back and gives everyone back their memories Everything's going to rely on Sam having to fill in the gaps. Well, Andre now, too. And Andre now, too. Yeah. Um, so moving forward, we kind of touched on Sam's health a bit. The Rufus stuff, we don't have to touch on because we already know who the culprit yeah, is. Yeah, he's just working for Dean Chetty. Everything that Kate said, you know, it, it, it sucks because she could have just been playing victim. And Rufus ain't do jack. Yeah, and we don't know. Reflection on real life. It is a reflection on real life because... A lot of this happens all the time. We don't know if she's telling the truth or if she's just trying to put the blame on someone else. It's a sad reality that like sometimes, sometimes, you know, there's a lot of allegations that happen to people. Yeah. And sometimes, you know, it actually takes away from actual victims. Yeah. Who are actually being hurt. Yeah. And no one, you know, could, cause like, some people are saying, like, I always believe the victim. See, some people say that how people, some people say that they always believe the victim until otherwise proven. Mm-hmm. And that, I, I'm, I'm sort of usually in that, in that boat too. Yeah. But if there's enough evidence to, excuse me, to support that, to support that the accused is not actually, yeah. you know, like, for instance, if you look, look at, look at the, the Johnny Depp Amber Heard situation, you know, he wasn't fully innocent. Yeah. But there's more evidence to support, that she was the main abuser. That she was also an abuser in the situation yeah. too, though. Like this was this was a th- they both hurt each other in ways, but yeah. she wasn't as innocent as 
you know she what was you, trying to make yeah whether yeah. whether you whether you're on amber heard side or not i think we can just fully say because i'm not trying to say anything i'm just saying we can fully come to the conclusion that um she was not as innocent as she was claiming to be yeah regardless both, of the nuance right they both did wrong in that situation yeah but but yeah. johnny depp johnny depp in that situation johnny depp his defense for himself his you know his defamation and all that was you know unnecessary like he was getting you know blamed for things he didn't do yeah and you know made out to first situation to be far worse than it really was yeah so you see cases like that all the time johnny Depp and amber heard being the biggest ones mm -hmm. you know and then now the man and now everybody you know is, is trying to you know take him off the blacklist now and it's just like you know it's wild you know yeah and you see this all the time it does put into perspective because there are a lot of really bad evil people nasty people out there that shouldn't get away like yeah. rufus isn't innocent at all though yeah. Like in general, Rufus is an a-hole. Yeah, absolutely. And he has done so some stuff. It, it would be believable that yeah. he would do that. Exactly. But we also don't know because he has been wiping people's memories, messing around with memories. Yeah, we don't know. So for all we know, it could have happened. It very well could have. It very well could have happened. And now based just purely off of what happened to Marie. Yeah, and also the fact that she made him do the Jumanji thing. Yeah. Now, we don't know why she made him do the Jumanji thing. It could have been like she made him do the Jumanji thing because she just did, at the time it seemed because she, you know, she wanted to stop him from laughing at the Golden Boy situation. So maybe she was just defending Golden Boy's honor by doing that. Mm -hmm. But now, you know, after the episode, it makes you it makes you think that, like, hmm, maybe she was trying to defend her own honor yeah. by getting revenge yeah. for him, you know, abusing her. And taking yeah. advantage of her. Yeah. We have no idea what really happened there. Yeah. It, it does make you question, though. Yeah. You know? Because even she was messing around with Luke's memory this whole mm -hmm. time, too. So it's it's really hard to understand. Did she ever truly love him? Or was she just with him because she had to make sure his memory was wiped? I think. There's just a lot of questions with her. I think she had love for him. Mm -hmm. I definitely think she had love for for Luke. Mm -hmm. Um, she clearly, obviously, loves Andre too. Mm -hmm. But I think she had love for Luke in some way. Mm -hmm. Um, obviously, she had love for the for her friends in general because she didn't want to do it. Yeah, like that was not something she wanted to do. Yeah. And, and and she was crying to Dean Shetty about it. Yeah. You know, having to lie to her friends. So, you know, um, I don't know. It makes you really question. It makes you question a lot of things, Definitely. man. Um, then the trackers in the body now, of course. Yeah. It's a very. Who put them in, though? I mean, it's a very, it's a very, it's a very VOD thing to do, though. You know what I mean? It's a very VOD thing to do oh yeah absolutely but who put them in i don't know if kate has the ability to put them in no i mean it could have happened when they were being wiped you know like when they were put yeah. to sleep they could have just came in did a little surgery or they could have had another suit because it looks like there was no incisions well, that's anything. what i'm saying so the only other thing that i could see is that they had another suit that could maybe phase through people yeah you know take it and place it in yeah and you know and like you know <laughs> thank god that marie has blood abilities she, she shows you how important blood is blood wow plot. yeah it shows that, you how actually, important blood is. that also shows like how her abilities are too because mm -hmm. we found out she can control other people's blood now she can find out she can know those people menstrual cycle <laughs> there is like a a very like unknown factor to marie yeah because we don't know the extent of you know, because for all we know, she could, you know, I know we had this discussion before about Homelander. Mm -hmm. For all we know, she can go up and, just... and he's done. Oh, yeah. We don't know. We have no idea. The... And again, Homelander is always a big question mark. Yeah. I'm pretty always, sure. It's always us trying to figure out, like, yeah. who could, you know, go up against I, Homelander. I mean, I'm pretty sure in the comic books, um, no, I'm going to, I'm going to ask my assistant 
Well, I don't want to know. No, no, no. I'm going to ask my assistant if we know Homelander's uh, limits without them giving me details. Because I want to know if the comic books ever explained it. I don't know if we do. I feel like I can't give too much, but okay. No. Um, without giving me any plot details or spoilers answer <laughs> yes <laughs> or no do we find out homelanders limitations in the boys comic book answer yes or no only <laughs> If it's a whole paragraph, I ain't reading it. Yeah, I'm gonna, gonna give some some spoilery details. Okay, the answer the answer is yes. Okay, it oh, just gave yes. Yeah, it just gave yes. Okay, good. Job. It didn't give me anything. Good job. Yeah, I asked. <laughs> yeah, it says yes. So in the comic books, we find out what Homelander's limitations are. Mm -hmm. But as for the show, we don't know. We don't know yeah. what his limitations are. I'm actually I'm actually glad it didn't tell me anything. I've always been curious to know if we ever find that out. Yeah, but obviously, if you look it up, you're gonna get spoilers. Yeah, if I look it up, we're gonna get spoilers. Yeah. It's just like looking you up. Have doc to find someone and ask them. Right, right, right. Yeah. So very nice, very nice. <laughs> but yeah, anyways. So yeah, so we find out his um, we find out that he has limitations. So we don't know what it is. Yeah. We'll see. Please don't spoil us in the comment comments if you read the, the you know comic books and graphic novels. Please don't spoil us. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we'll we'll cover that basis unless we've seen because I asked what his limitations were. So hmm. Because in the in the show we also saw that he does he's not mentally the strongest. We know that he has a a weak we know that we've seen his weaknesses in show yeah. in the show with like, you know, his 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 love for fame and acceptance. Yeah. Maybe I should ask the question. Answer only yes or no. Here we go. In the comic books, <laughs> he loves his AI so much for research. For research, it helps with it helps with like because sometimes Google you have to like read like a bunch of like five different articles and I and I still like reading my articles. Don't get me wrong, but if I need a quick answer, man, I need sometimes you just got to. These are tools to use. These are tools to be used. Not to replace people, making that very clear right now. Um, anyways, um, in the comic books, do we find out Homelander's physical limitations? Answer yes or no only. <laughs> no spoilers or plot. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. So we find out what his physical limitations are. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, we'll have to see if, you know, whenever the boys comes back. Yeah. How this would, you know, how we can maybe tie Marie into that. Yeah. Well, and we'll have, we'll have to see just how it how how Gen V ends up anyway. Yeah. You know, because they for all we know, they could never cross over. Yeah, they can never cross over. So, but, you know, obviously they're going to try to milk this as much as they can. At least yeah. five seasons. I can see a decent five seasons. Well, they, they might just make Gen V their own thing. Too. No, I mean, like I'm talking about like, the boys in general. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we'll see. Maybe um, we're on like season four. We're about to be on season four. Yeah. Once so. they start paying SAG actors yes. properly. Hey, you damn actors. Um, once they start doing that, then they will be on season. Yeah, we'll be on season four. Um, but anyways, unless you have anything else you want to, uh, unless you have anything else you want to add, I mean, I kind of, we kind of yeah. wrote everything down. Everything was kind of self-explanatory. We're just kind of yeah. comment, commentating on it. So I think the only other thing is, you know, just seeing how to get back that relationship between Sam and Emma, because they had a very like kind of deep thing going. Yeah. And like they're going to get it back. They have to. I think they're going to force uh, Kate to just give everybody's powers back. I mean, or they in that moment they're gonna force Kate to to well, fix everybody yeah. up. Yeah, it's very possible. Like, well, if you want to start atoning for your sins, you can start by giving us back our memories. Yeah, you know. 
But we, I didn't even know she had the ability to do that. Yeah. I only knew she had the ability to, to manipulate. But I mean, in that, it is manipulating. Yeah, no, you're right. Absolutely. It was like, oh, if I forget your past 48 hours. Right. Mm-hmm. You know? Now, it, it, it brings the question, does she suppress the memories or does she remove them entirely? Because so far, it just seems as if she's adding a blocker. Mm-hmm. You know, kind of like a wheel of time thing with the, yeah, it might with the one blocker, power, just was, like blocking it. Because she was able to, you know, give Andre his memories back. Yeah, or at least allow him to remember. Yeah. So it might just be like a blocker is like, all right, well, you know what happened, but I'm just blocking it off so you can't remember. Yeah. So that's definitely possible. Absolutely. Yeah. All right, well, uh, you want to go ahead and, and close out the video? Yeah. Uh, if you guys like what you saw, make sure to like and subscribe and comment down below your thoughts on this episode. Um, and if you want to see the full reaction to this episode and all the other stuff we're doing on both of our channels, make yes. sure to head on over to our Patreon. Link will be in the description below. But yeah, I think that's it for us. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.